I think of the book by Corey Ten Boom called The Hiding Place. And she gives a great story about this very verse um, in Everything Give Thanks. And if you don't know the story, she and her sister were in Holland during World War II. They um, set up this underground to help people get away. Um, and they were eventually caught and they were taken to a concentration camp called Ravensbrück. And this was horrible, right? And, um, but they were able to get their Bible and to sneak it in with them. And, and it tells a story. So her sister, Betsy, who ended up dying, but she had so much faith and this was growing and Corey would see this faith. Anyway, so one day uh, they're in this, this, this barracks and there's hundreds of women in there and they're sleeping three high and they're in there. And then all of a sudden there's fleas, right? She gets bitten by fleas and she's Get, jumps up and she, Betsy, look what's happening, right? We're getting, how can we do this? How can we do this? And then she says, Betsy says, um, and she was almost like she was praying and says, Lord, show us how. Then she said, I've got it, Corey. I've got it. God gave us the answer as he always does. We were reading, uh, what were we reading this morning? And he said, we were reading 1 Thessalonians. That's right. That's exactly right. We were reading in 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse um, uh, 18, in everything, give thanks. And Corey sat there and going, give thanks for what? <laughs> that we're sitting in this foul, you know, fleas. And she says, no, 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 for, for in everything, not just some things. And, and Corey, Corey says, I am not going to give thanks to God for fleas. Um, but Betsy said, Corey, this is what the scripture says. And she says, so I gave this prayer, thanking God for these foul, horrible circumstances and, and thankful for fleas. She says, but I was sure that she was wrong this time. And then she goes on and talks about how God used those fleas to keep the guards out of their room and gave them the opportunity because they'd smuggled in a Bible to teach the gospel, to give people wow. hope in the concentration camp in ways that she never imagined, but it was worth praising God for what he sees, big mm -hmm. eternal picture, rather than just the individual thing. Mm -hmm.